Hi, I'm Ina, and this is What's in the Bag for the week of November 22nd. Let's get stuffed. Let's jump into our greens pack. For our baby greens this week, we have early mizuna, a celery lettuce, Toscano kale, a gourmet lettuce mix, and sprinkles of carrot leaves. The carrot leaves are a perfect complement to a traditional carrot dish. For our microgreens, we have Miss America Mizuna, a brand new variety called Crimson Tide. We have red Mizuna and sprinkles of bronze fennel. Bronze fennel has a little bit of a licorice flavor, so that adds a perfect amount of sweetness. Look how beautiful this mix of herbs and edible flowers is this week. Definitely a special treat for our holiday celebrations. We have lots of different varieties this week. Blue spice basil, opal basil. There's also a ton of flowers. Viola flowers, marigold flowers, nepotella flowers, dianthus flowers. And we also have a little bit of a special treat with the toothache buttons and oxalis leaves. For our shrooms this week, we actually have a really nice mix of blue oyster and royal trumpet mushrooms. When I cook with these, I notice that the blue oyster mushrooms have a really strong umami flavor. And the royal trumpet mushrooms are actually a little bit more mild, but they really hold on to the flavors of all the things that you're cooking. So those actually will complement each other really well. So for our members that receive the shrooms pack, you'll also be getting a surprise of lion's mane mushroom powder. Did you know that lion's mane is actually used for cognitive function? So on the mornings that I'm having a particularly groggy morning, I'll actually mix the mushroom powder, the lion's mane mushroom powder in my morning coffee for an extra boost. Now our smoothies. We have Biscay Green, which has Farm One's Blue Spice Basil, Scarlet Thrills, named after the Scarlet Thrills mustard that's in there, and Red or Dead, which has oxalis leaves. You'll definitely taste the tart flavor in this one. All of our members this week are receiving this surprise, Shichimi Toragashi. It's traditionally a Japanese spice blend, and you'll typically see this on top of udon or tempura, or on top of rice dishes, but it's actually really versatile. You could even sprinkle this on your avocado toast in the morning, or your popcorn if you're looking for an extra flavor kick. Let us know what you try it with. If you celebrate the Thanksgiving holiday, you'll be sure to impress all of your guests with some of the recipes at our weekly meal plan. It incorporates all of the ingredients from this week's pack. You'll be the star of your celebration. It's also important to remember to recognize and listen to indigenous and native stories on this day. How can you recognize indigenous and native people with your friends and family this year? Thanks so much for tuning in and I'll see you again next week.